Hi, my name is Darshan Sukumar, and I'm the LabVIEW intern at Digilent. And I'd like to share with you guys the PMOD Max Sonar Sub VIs that I created. Here's a demo using the PMOD Max Sub VIs. Um, it uses a Chipkit WF32, the PMOD Max Sonar, the PMOD HB5, it's a H bridge, and then a little motor with the flag attached to it. Uh, when somebody comes within two feet behind you, the motor will turn on and the flag will bump your arm. All right, let's show how easy it is to read values from the max sonar using the sub VIs. Let's open our block diagram. Uh, we want to go to Maker Hub, Links. We'll pin that. We need the links initialize and close. And then under sensors, PMODs, max sonar, we need open, read, and close. Now let's align those top edges. Good. Uh, we're on COM port, so let's make a serial port. And then we need a control for our UART. Let's align those. Connect the resource and air wires. Same thing here. Connect the UART channel. Let's create an indicator for our distance reading. Connect the resource wires and the UART channel again. Let's move that down a little bit. Cool. Um, and then let's connect these last wires. And then we're going to need a while loop so we can read our values continuously. Let's make a stop button. Let's move this wire over a little bit. Here we go. And let's move this guy over too. Why not? All right, let's go to the front panel. So we are on COM port 22. That's the WF32. UART channel 1. Um, let's click Run. So the board's initializing. And all right, so we're getting our distance reading. Let's wave my hand in front of it. Uh, let's point it at the back wall. So the greatest distance it can read is 255 inches. We're on UART channel 1 because UART channel 0 is how we communicate to LabVIEW with the WF32. Alright, and here's the demo one last time. Make sure to check out LabViewMakerHub.com for more tutorials and projects, and ask any questions you have on the MakerHub forums at LabViewMakerHub.com forums.